<laughs> this guy, this guy, I think, has already um, apologized for uh, this comment. But I got to tell you that, um, and I don't know what it is. Like, all these Trump supporters, when they talk to a British person, it's as if, like, they think, like, nobody's ever going to hear this. It's all right. This guy's you can form. feel comfortable. But this Tell guy, me what you think. This guy's sitting in the, in, in the, in the rotunda of the U.S. Cong- uh, of, 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 the, of, the, of the House, right? And is he in the House or is he in North Carolina? There's a real problem with, uh, also with North Carolina politicians. They also don't seem to understand the technology involved in, in, uh, in, in video. Like they, it's almost as they think, like, oh, this is just live. It's not actually. I mean, honestly, between me and you. And so here he is in the, in, in the middle of Congress, U.S. Congressperson. And you know what? With all due respect, I know people make mistakes. I just don't think you can apologize and sort of say, like, can we just leave that behind? Can we just forget I said that? Let's listen to Congressman Robert Pittinger talking I, I, about I, what's I, going on in North Carolina. Go ahead. I, 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 with, with respect, Congressman, I, I don't think the people on the streets last night and the night before were protesting against Lyndon B. Johnson's uh, almost half a well, century old policies. You, what, 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 what is their grievance in their mind? Well, no, the grievance in their mind is uh, the, the, the animus, the anger. They hate white people because white people are successful and they're not. I mean, yes, it is. It is a welfare state. We have, we have spent you know, trillions of dollars on welfare, but we put people in bondage so that they can't be all that they're capable of being. And, you know, America was, is a country of opportunity and freedom and liberty. It didn't come that way because of a great government who provided everything for everyone. No. The destiny of America, the, the freedom to come to this country, uh, where they're still coming to our shores, is because so, they can take their, their work ethic and their, their, their hard effort and, and put up their capital and their risk and, and build out their lives. I love the look on the face of like British um, uh, journalists when they're talking to people like this, because the guy just sitting back, just going like, and you can see them talking to themselves and trying to clench their teeth, going like, I can't fucking believe this guy is saying this to me. It's like you read about it at home that America is filled with complete I, I think morons just, I think and mongoloids just, right. and then you come. Right. And, and indeed it's true. <laughs> I think they're honestly like the, the same guy from The Guardian who was talking to that racist from like I, I'm just so shocked that they're saying this to me and I think what we're going to honestly, I think like what you're going to start to see is like like one quarter of the British TV industry is just going to come over here and try and do these <laughs> these interviews because they're just like, this is a fucking gold mine. Holy <laughs> shit. So that's what it is. The reason why people are uh, protesting, rioting, the reason why there's this anger is because for whatever reason, these black people, when they came over here, didn't take their capital and invest. <laughs> And they resent the whites. I like also how he's soft-spoken. I got him talking like I'm really nice. I mean, it's just sad. You know, there's only so many basketball players and beat companies that can take off. And, you know, I know Dr. Drake had a good sell out to Apple, but, you know, that it just can't be the way for the rest of them. So they're out burning us because they hate us. Yes. It's really sad. Sad. I wish they could unleash their potential. I mean, I wish that so much you could call me Malcolm X. Can I just ask one more? Can I ask just one more question about your cameras do these record in when you come from britain or of course i'm just assuming that this is just sort of a bilateral mean you chat a uh, and b when you talk british that doesn't record anything i say does it we have a thing called opposite day in america hey folks sam cedar here i just got back from a uh, company-wide meeting accounting is really coming down on me hard we need to get to a hundred thousand subscribers as soon as possible so uh, please enjoy this uh, channel. Subscribe right up, right up, down. right down there.